Hello, welcome to the Soul Print Positive Energy Circle. I'm really glad you're here today. So um, this is actually being released on Easter Sunday. And, um, you know, for several of you, you may not see this video for several days because you're busy doing, you know, what you're doing. So um, I just want to reiterate the fact that even if you are doing the Energy Circle on when Monday or Tuesday or, or you know next week sometimes, um, your thoughts and your energies literally join up with other like energies, and so it's always valuable. It's always a valuable exercise. It, there isn't sort of one time that's better than other times. Um, so I don't want you to feel like you know if you missed it. Um, or you didn't see it first thing, you know, Saturday, Sunday morning, that it's not valid. It is absolutely still valid. Um, and just one more note that I want to make note of, just because it's a little bit heartwarming. Um, the Canadian federal government has officially declared both the Tooth Fairy and the Easter Bunny as essential services. And it just warm your heart. Okay, so today's positive energy circle is a really special one because for those of you who follow the Insights channel um, or, you know, other channels or other places where they're talking and have been talking for a long time about raising the vibration of the earth. So what is going on globally, as, as scary as it is, as... Um, as we are losing people, as people are getting sick, it is part of the process of the, the raising of the vibrations. And that process is all about shifting the earth from the sort of um, vibrational level that it is sitting at and lifting it up to a higher level so that it is more easy to achieve some of the sort of goals that a lot of people on the planet think are incredibly important, like saving the planet, you know, treating others with compassion and dignity, not putting um, selfish interests first. So that's the goal of, of the, the raising of the vibration. It is literally, we are coming upon a time where it really is sort of like, um, dark against light, okay, I, I don't like to use the phrase it's good against evil, because I don't think that's, I think it, it has more to do with positive light filled energy is sort of um, gently or forcefully trying to push the lower vibrational, darker, heavier energy into place. So that's our focus today. That's what we're looking to do. So I've chitter chattered long enough. Um, thank you so much for being here. And let us start our positive energy circle for raising the vibration of the planet. So let's take a couple of deep breaths here. And remember the best um, way to handle the breath in and out is to count four to four on the inhale. One, two, three, four, and six on the exhale. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that's the rhythm that you want to keep. And I want you to actually focus on breathing in and breathing out. And I want you to focus on counting those numbers until the rhythm just really becomes set and established as your current breathing pattern. So we're going to have take, continue to take those lovely, lovely deep breaths in and exhale. And you're going to feel your eyes growing heavy and wanting to sort of flutter closed. And please allow them to do that. Should you hear any noises that are sudden or loud, and whether they come from this video or just from your own environment, you will hear them, acknowledge them, but they're not necessarily going to um, really disturb you on any a deeper level because you are focused on what you were doing you're focused on my voice and you're starting to notice that with all of those lovely inhales and exhales that your body has become incredibly incredibly relaxed 
And that's important. I want you to really drop into that sense of deep, deep relaxation. Your body is feeling the effects of, the, of the, those breaths in and out, in and out. Your feet are getting very, very relaxed. You can wiggle your toes and you know there's no tension in your feet. You're going to move that up to the ankles. And that deep sense of relaxation is moving all the way up to your hips. And into your stomach, you can feel those muscles relaxing. And up into your torso. Into the shoulders. And down the arms to your fingers. Deep, deep relaxation. You're so relaxed, you almost feel like you're floating. And that incredible energy moves up. To your neck. Your throat. And with every breath, it is traveling down your spine. You can feel vertebrae by vertebrae just relaxing. And finally, that really incredible relaxation now moves from your neck, from your throat into your head. You can literally feel your jaw relaxing. There is no clenching. There is no tightness in the jaw. Your cheeks are relaxing. Your eyes are so deeply closed and so comfortable. And again, there is no weight. There is no stress. It is a a state of relaxation that is so deep, you feel like you're floating. That energy moves up through the forehead and up to the top of the head. And that beautiful energy is escaping from your head and it's creating a beautiful bubble of protection all around you. That bubble has beautiful soft, soft colors, almost like a soap bubble. There's a little bit of pink and yellow, maybe some blue or lavender. Mostly it's white and it just gently forms itself completely around you. So now you know that you are relaxed and you are protected and you are ready to move forward and do the important vibrational work that we're going to do today. So our focus is on the vibrational energy of the planet. So I want you to imagine or create a picture in your mind's eye. You're going to find yourself in an opened area. It might be a field of wheat or corn. It might be a pathway moving through a forest. Perhaps it is a lovely garden. It could even be the area beside an ocean or a large body of water. But I want you to create this place and I want you to see yourself standing in the middle of the area that you have created. It is outside. You are connecting and standing on the earth, whether that is the sand of an ocean or the dirt of a wheat field or the grass, perhaps, of a garden. But you are on the earth 
and you are standing and you are looking at this amazing place that you were able to create using your mind's eye or your imagination. Now, you're going to create pillars of light that come up from the ground and shoot up, up right into the sky. They are brilliant, brilliant columns of light. And everywhere your eye goes, as you gently move through this landscape, turn around and around in 360 degree circles, everywhere your eye looks, another beautiful white pillar rises from the ground and shines its incredible white light up far, far into the sky. Find any spot that does not have a beautiful pillar of light and make sure that you have as much light in the area as you can. In your imagination, in your mind's eye, or physically, if you are having trouble holding the image, Bring your hands to your chest in a prayer position. And I want you to just hold it there and continue looking at the incredible pillars of light. And as you do that, you understand that those lights hold the vibration of love, clarity, purity, and peace. And I want you to very, very gently open your eyes. Oh, sorry, open your hands. Do not open your eyes. Open your hands. And you can see those same beautiful white pillars of light coming from the palms of your hands. And you're going to add your divine light and love. And it connects with these incredible pillars or columns of divine light. In doing so, you recognize and understand that you are doing the work, the soul work, to help the vibration of the earth move up to a higher level. And that higher level vibration is going to impact everything upon the earth. The dirt, the nutrients in the ground, <clears throat> the fields, the waters, the lands, the animals, birds, fish, and all the people who are ready and able or willing to connect with those beautiful, beautiful lights, who are ready to feel the planet just shift upward so that we can move away from a me attitude and move closer to a more productive, gentle and kind we attitude. Relax your hands, let them drop and continue just slowly looking around at the incredible landscape with all of these incredible columns of white light. It almost feels a little bit magical. 
It's an incredible feeling knowing that you have created the light and the power and the energy that can rise up from the earth and lift the vibration to a higher level, even as it heals. Even as it heals. Just stand in that place with that energy for a little bit of time. Just really appreciate the brilliance of what you have created and knowing that it is creating like energy, not only on the globe and around the globe, but also in higher energy vibrations, higher energy vibrational beings, whether they are angels or guardians, guides, and their prayers and their energy joins with yours as they wait, work tirelessly to do their part to shift the vibration of the earth higher and lighter. Very, very slowly, you're going to see the columns just sort of wavering and ascending. They're just going to sort of start moving in an upward, gentle direction, actually leaving the ground and lifting up and ever so slowly, slowly, slowly moving up into the sky. And while you're watching this amazing light movement in front of your eyes, I want you to just take a moment and send out loving energy to whatever area you feel is most in need at this time. So perhaps you are sending energy to the frontline workers, whether that is the um, first responders, whether that is the nurses and doctors in a hospital. It could also be the janitors and the cooks. It is the bus drivers. It is the, the people working in grocery stores, keeping our world going. It is the people who keep your utilities running, your lights on. It is the military in all of its forms. Those who are working tirelessly within your own communities or in a broader way around the world. We're going to send blessing and light to wherever you would like it to go. Perhaps there is a special person that you would like to send extra protection to, do so now. Or perhaps there is a situation that you would like that kind of beautiful, healing, powerful light to surround them. Take a moment, send it out to as many places, people, or things as you would like. And if for whatever reason, if you've just sort of drawn a blank, then send the energy out where it is simply most needed. And those columns are moving higher and higher into the sky. And now you can just see a glimmer of them, assuring you that the positive energy that you have created and sent has gone off into the planet and around the planet to do the work it needs to do. I want you to take a very, very deep breath in. Breathe in now. Hold it for a moment and breathe out. You're slowly becoming aware of the sounds and the smells around you. Perhaps you can feel the bed or the chair, wherever it is you are reclined or at rest. 
and start to hear the, the noises of silence where you are. Or the noises of a bustling, busy life that goes on around you. I'm going to count to three, and when I reach three, you're going to have moved from that deeply relaxed state to a state of energy and clarity. And you're going to hold the deep relaxation, but it is not going to sort of slow you down. You're just going to feel really wonderful. And whatever it is you're wanting to do for the rest of this day or the next, you're going to have the focus and energy to do that. If by chance you are heading off into your sleep time, then know that when you wake up, that vibrant energy will be awake, will be waiting for you as you open your eyes to start your day. One. Two. Three. Open your eyes, look around. You might want to shake out your fingers or your toes or your arms. And you feel wonderful and fabulous and you should because you have done some really incredible energy work here and you have done a, a small part that is so significant and helping to raise the vibration of the planet and the energies that surround it. So that as a civilization, we can move towards a more enlightened time. Thank you ever so much for your contribution to the uh, Soulprint Positive Energy Circle. You guys are amazing, and I thank you for the work you're doing energetically, whether it is on your, on your own self or whether it is a situation or whether it is the planet. And I also thank you from the bottom of my heart for the support that you give the Soul Print channels, whether it is the Soul Print Intuitive Tarot or it is the Soul Print Insights channel. Thank you because we're building an amazing community there in both places. So until next time, stay positive and stand in your light. Bye.